Hi everyone, this is Knowledge Topper and in this particular video we will understand uh, another type of risk which is uh, liquidity risk like what is liquidity risk uh, we already uh, covered uh, uh, reputational risk as well as uh, credit risk in our recent videos uh, so if you want to know more about those as well uh, you can watch it uh, by clicking uh, um, the thumbnail uh, at the end of this video uh, but before moving towards our today's topic, which is uh, what is liquidity risk, uh, if you didn't subscribe our channel yet, uh, uh, please do subscribe our channel, Knowledge Topper, as well as like our Facebook page. And do join our Facebook group as well, where you find a lot of good material related to these topics as well as from other courses as well. So let's get into this video. Um, let us start by recalling uh, what the term liquidity stands for. Um, you know liquidity basically you can describe it uh, as uh, the ability of a company or you can say of an individual to pay its debts by selling off its asset or securities without suffering tremendous losses it is as simple as that basically you can say that uh, uh, liquidity describes how quickly something you own can be converted into cash uh, now, uh, moving towards our uh, today's topic, which is liquidity risk. Uh, you can say liquidity risk uh, refers to the lack of uh, marketability of a security or, uh, or asset, which cannot be sold or bought quickly enough to prevent or minimize a loss. Okay. Uh, it is typically reflected in large price movement. Uh, simply put, uh, you can say that uh, liquidity risk uh, as an expression describes the possibility that an individual trader or business may not be able to convert its cash into uh, its asset into cash and uh, meet its short term financial obligations. Uh, generally, liquidity uh, risk arises when immediate cash needs cannot be satisfied due to the illiquidity of an asset or due to market inefficiencies. Simply, you can understand this as lack of marketability of a security or an asset or you can say uh, like uh, the possibility that an individual trader or business may not be able to convert its cash, its asset into cash and meet uh, its, uh, its short term financial obligation. Uh, now, uh, maybe you have heard about liquidity risk. Uh, uh, like um, uh, prior to the global financial crisis uh, like uh, the majority of financial institution uh, took li liquidity for granted uh, as you know uh, people may learn from their past mistakes simply in the case of global financial crisis uh, where the majority of financial institution took liquidity for granted and uh, they pay uh, little to no attention uh, to the availability of funds like how much of funds or how many of funds uh, are available to them uh, so liquidity risk had not been on the radar until it had it hit all the news headlines during the crisis in 2007 and 2008 if you want to know more about uh, liquidity risk you must uh, watch uh, uh, or uh, learn about uh, global financial crisis uh, uh, in 2007 and it uh, you may find uh, very good uh, support related to the understanding of uh, uh, our today's topic of liquidity risk because uh, uh, the whole financial crisis is mainly about uh, liquidity okay so during this time many institutions uh, struggled to maintain adequate liquidity and it resulted in both bank failures and the need for central bank uh, uh, to inject liquidity into national financial system to keep the uh, economy floating okay so uh, like this extreme risk was a major factor in the weakness of uh, financial institution and uh, uh, it, it, it ultimately led to the uh, bankruptcy as well so uh, now moving forward the global uh, financial crisis uh, uh, now forced government and major financial institutions to reassess the importance of liquidity and today they are aware of uh, the liquidity risk that comes with insufficient liquidity and take necessary actions to prevent it from happening it again 
So uh, this is basically uh, mainly about uh, uh, global financial crisis, which leads to uh, high liquidity risk uh, for financial institution. Now we move forward towards uh, our types of liquidity risk uh, and uh, examples. So mainly there are two types of uh, liquidity risk. One is uh, uh, market liquidity risk and the other one is funding liquidity risk. Uh, when we talk about uh, the first type, which is market liquidity risk, uh, basically you can say that um, it is the possibility that when you need to trade, the market liquidity is poor making it difficult to buy or sell assets okay like for example assume you own an expensive car and you need to sell it quickly however due to bad market conditions uh, uh, it can only be sold at a low discounted price and in this case uh, the asset does not uh, uh, and in this case the asset does have a value but owing to the temporary lack of buyers this value cannot be realized okay uh, the second is uh, the funding liquidity asset, uh, funding liquidity risk uh, and um, it is the possibility that when a company needs to pay off its bills, it may fail to do so on time due to a lack of funding available. Okay, like for example, uh, you can say that during the period of um, uh, during the slowdown period of uh, business, uh, uh, many businesses may be exposed to funding liquidity risk of its obligations due to uh, like uh, due at that at that time are greater than uh, you can say that uh, the operating cash flow generated like uh, mainly you can say that because of the low capacity of generating cash flows uh, uh, many businesses may not be able to uh, pay their financial obligations because of the slowdown of business and this leads to funding liquidity risk okay so this is all about liquidity risk hope you understand about uh, liquidity risk uh, in detail uh, if you like this video thumbs up do subscribe our channel knowledge topper as well as like our facebook page and do join our facebook group as well where you find a lot of good material related to these topics as well as from other courses as well we will discuss uh, other types of risk in our next upcoming videos. If you want to watch that, you can watch it by clicking uh, uh, the link in the description or at the end of this video, I will attach uh, a thumbnail of uh, playlists where you can find uh, all uh, risk related videos uh, uh, in the thumbnail. So this is the video for all of you guys. Thank you so much, everyone. It's time to say bye bye.